Hey guys, what's up, it's Raven. Can I just say, as a young business owner, this is major for me. I hosted a luxurious three-day work retreat for my team and I, and we stayed in a super cool $3 million smart home in Joshua Tree, California. Just arrived to Palm Springs. Here's our ride for the trip. Getting picked up in a gray Tessie. We're letting the Tesla do the self-driving and it's literally making the turns and everything. This is full self-driving. Watch the wheel. No hands. Look, Ma, no hands. Oh my God. So our house is on the hill. Oh, I see it. We're here at the Wonder House. Wow, very fancy. This is very much I feel like I have pictures of this house on my Pinterest board of the landscaping. Hello. 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 We made it. Hey guys, what's up? It's Raven. I'm here in Joshua Tree, California with my team and we're staying at this amazing $3 million home. I'll explain why we're here, but first I want to give you a tour of this amazing house. So we're walking in through the front door into the main area. And in here you have the living room, which has a beautiful view. Looking out into Joshua Tree. Patio space out there with a grill and everything. We even have a telescope. And then of course, look at this fireplace, gigantic TV, really cute furniture. I love the aesthetic. And then on this side, I guess you would call this like a work area. It's kind of a little office setup, but then there's a wet bar. So it's like work and play. Really cute wet bar actually, all decked out with everything you need to make a cocktail, mini fridge, sink and everything. And this actually goes out to the pool, which I'll show you in a second. And then you have the kitchen, which is very like modern, state-of-the-art kitchen. Really nice appliances and features. Like everything is just so cute and modern and luxurious in here. We even have a full washer and dryer here. This is a three bedroom house. So there's one bedroom here, here, and one towards the front. This is the room that me and my mom are staying in. This is technically the primary bedroom. Really cute in here. See all the Joshua Tree themed decor. Kind of rustic, but super modern, kind of desert vibes. Really nice walk-in closet through here as well. And of course, the workspace with everything you could possibly need. And the bathroom is really cute. I really like the finishes in here. Let me put the countertop and everything. Super cute with the windows. You see all the Joshua trees speaking through. I think that's a Joshua tree up there. And everything is like branded with the Wander logo, which is really cute. Look at this shower. Like look. Super cute big shower. And comes stocked with a Dyson hair dryer. Very fancy and all the attachments. Very much luxury. This bedroom also leads out to a patio space which connects around to that main patio to the living room. This is the room that Taylor is staying in, another bedroom. Again, fully decorated, all cute with all the little details. Her patio actually leads out to the pool and the hot tub so she has a really nice view. And she also has a workspace in here with the full wraparound screen and everything you could need, TV and everything. And her bathroom is really nice too. She's got the light up mirrors, the double sink. Look at these faucets, so cute, super modern. Another really big, nice shower in here. So let's go look at the pool. We'll go outside. Cute little plunge pool, if you will, and a hot tub. Hot tub and another little seating area up here. They got cornhole game set up. And you have the beautiful scenery all around. And every 
direction. It's like fully surrounding views. Nice little outdoor dining. The telescope looks out this way, grill. Oh, and around this way, there is a fire pit. It's actually pretty cold out here right now, so we will definitely be using that. So this door leads into the garage where you will find the Tesla that was included with our stay. This is the Wander House Tesla that like comes with the house. Very cute, it's got its own little charging station in here as well. And then on the other side of the garage, it's like fully decked out in here. Ping pong table and a whole gym, obviously, with this really cool mural. Peloton, oh my God. a rowing thing? That's fancy. The rowing thing, treadmill, Peloton, and a sauna. I don't think I will be working out, but I will go in that sauna. <laughs> if it were summertime, we could open up this garage door and have like an indoor outdoor thing and go right out to the pool. Like I said, it's a little cold right now, so we might not be doing that, but that's a cool feature as well. Okay, so what's going on and why are we here? First of all, who's we? I'm here with Taylor hey. and Brianna and my mother, Chef Tony. So this is the Raven Elise TV team. Taylor, head of special projects operations. <laughs> yeah. Brianna. Head of influencer management brand partnerships. And Chef Tony. Business manager and uh, chef. <laughs> <laughs> I do social media strategy and I manage the entire business. And Raven, the talent. <laughs> Um, so we are here at the Wander Joshua Tree property. And Wander, in case you don't know, is a network of smart homes, emphasis on smart homes, around the globe that are specifically set up for remote work. So the idea is that you're blending work and play. So you're in these destinations. It's very nice and luxurious, but they have everything perfectly set up for remote work. So all the workstations that I just showed you, that's the reason. This isn't sponsored or anything. Um, I discovered Wander a few weeks ago and booked a workation for myself and a friend in Oregon and suggested that the team have their retreat at one of the Wander properties. So while we're here, we plan on doing some planning for next year, uh, getting our goals in line, getting our content brainstormed, but we also have some fun activities. Like we have some spa treatments, we have a private chef experience, we have a tour of the Yucca Valley and a lot more stuff, so. This is the first official Raven Elise TV team retreat. We're gonna be working and planning, but we're gonna be, it's a retreat. So we're trying to make it fun and also very luxurious. That's why we have the luxurious house and some luxurious activities. So stay tuned to see what all we do. But First, we're jumping right in. Me and Taylor literally just got in town yes. like a minute ago, but we're jumping right in with some work stuff. So we actually have some presentations lined up. So we're about to start with our first presentation. So it took a little minute, but me and Taylor figured out how to cast our devices to the big old TV so we can do our uh, presentations. Fireside. And sh yeah, fireside presentations. <laughs> so we're gonna gather around on the couches and listen to the history of my company. That's this presentation. So we can know where we've been, so we can know where we're going. <laughs> yeah. right. We went on a little secret field trip after our presentation. Maybe I'll post about the secret field trip on TikTok, maybe not, tune in to see. <laughs> But now we're back and we're cooking dinner. It's a team building exercise. It is. Led by Chef Tony, of course. <laughs> we're having Brussels sprouts, potatoes, zucchini, and what's the main thing? Filet mignon. Joshua Tree, it's 10 a.m. The team is here. I'm in my robe and pajamas. Taylor and my mom are in pajamas, but Brianna She's is formally prepared for her presentation. She has a cute outfit on, but we're gonna listen to her presentation in pajamas, I guess. And then we have something fun planned after that I'll show y'all. 
You ready for your massage, Me too, lady? First. Okay, yes. go ahead. Oh, I need to get yeah, video. Right, like, mom <laughs> <from> video. <laughs> yes. so, it's very yeah. first dinner. Taylor and I just finished our massage. Yes. But look at all of us in our little matching <laughs> wander robes. Brianna and my mom are about to get their treatments now. So just a little status update. After we all had our spa treatments, we reconvened for another presentation, you know, work session. This is a work retreat after all. We are here to discuss goals and plans and figure things out. So we had another session that lasted from 2 p.m. Mm -hmm. till now it's after 6 p.m. and we need to get ready to go to dinner. So we just had a good, you know, four hour long discussion session and honestly, we didn't even get to all the things we thought we were gonna get to. <laughs> How are you feeling about this? Tired. The work retreat. I think it's been productive. We've gotten some things accomplished. Um, not as much as I'd hoped, but our work is cut out for us. Our agenda that we came into this with was a very lofty agenda of like, we thought we were gonna figure this out and figure that out and talk about this and just run through stuff. And it's like not really happening like that, but we're having good conversations. We're making progress. It's not for nothing. I think it's been productive. I'm happy with it. And so now we're gonna balance out the deep discussion we just had with going to a nice dinner. Just put up to Spencer's for dinner. For my appetizer, I got ahi tuna tartare. We have some Caesar salad, some calamari. That was my second choice. I like calamari. Well, you're welcome to have some. I am not gonna eat all this. <laughs> and we have our cocktails. I got something citrusy. <laughs> Even Taylor has her mocktail. Yes. It's a Shirley, but we gonna roll with it. It's a Shirley, just a little Shirley. So the whole table, except for me, ordered the lamb. <laughs> Very fancy, but everybody got, you got like medium well, medium rare, medium. So all the different levels of lamb. And then I didn't get the lamb because I'm not a lamb girl, but I got braised short ribs. I'm going to smack the teeth. So it's night two, we've been back from dinner. We had a little, we took our desserts to go, tasted our desserts for a little bit. And now Taylor and I decided that we wanted to use up the amenities. So at first we were gonna get in the hot tub. We tried to turn the hot tub on. I think I turned on, it did not get hot. It's ice cold. We don't have the time or patience to wait for it to get hot. I'm sure it would be nice. But instead we are fire pitting, yes. Lit up the fire pit and we're gonna sit and have a little kiki, a little fireside chat. <laughs> if you will. Good morning. How you Good, how are you? So we are about to go on a Hummer tour around Joshua Tree to see the sights. I'm not sure what all this even includes, but we will find out together. It's nine o'clock in the morning and we're all about to pile in. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Just jumped out of the Hummer. Cat's claw bush, beware. So this is our first stop getting out of the Hummer, actually walking around. We are officially in Joshua Tree in the National Park. And it's crazy, all these huge boulders.
so it is about 3 p.m. now. We got done with our Joshua Tree Hummer tour. Got back to the house closer to about 1 p.m. And since then, my mom actually was contacted by the Wander people, like the people who own these properties. And they wanted to interview her, I guess, to use for like their socials and stuff. So shout out Wander. We've enjoyed the stay so far. It was two people from their team that came to interview my mom and just get some B-roll and get some footage of us, you know, staying in the house. So I didn't vlog any of that process because I didn't want to get in the way of what they were filming. But if they post it, like if it's live, I'll definitely share it with y'all. We didn't have any previous connections with Wander before we booked this place, but you might see us at some more Wander properties maybe after this. Now we are jumping back into presentations. Taylor has a presentation now that she's queuing up. We've been casting the computers to the TV. I know you guys are probably wondering like, discussing what? <laughs> what do you even mean? And it's too much to explain. Yeah, because it's a lot of stuff. It's a lot of stuff. When I say hours and hours of conversations, that much stuff. It's just hard to make Like, I don't know how to tell you in a quick one sentence type of way what we're talking about, what we're planning, what we're discussing. Of course, you know, I'm an influencer. Yeah. So it's all things influencer. It's all the background but, things that y'all don't see that keep her moving on the front end. So all the systems, all the structures, all the goals, all the KPIs, all of these things on the back end. Like CTRs, no, AVPs, KPIs, SOPs. You know, Do you have a better way of explaining it, Brianna? I if you could that in one, good. if you could say in one sentence, what have we been talking about? What have we been doing? A lot of it, I feel like, is goal oriented, and then figuring out how we take action on those goals. So we're developing those goals right now with Taylor, but we've also sort of been generally talking about goals the entire weekend. So we look, took a look back, see where we come from so that we could see where we're going. We made plans on what direction we want to go in, to put it simply, and we talked about a strategy to get to where we want to be. And now we're going to set some goals so that we can track them and see how what we're working on is affecting the bottom line of the business. All right, so we just finished another 14 million hour long discussion. <laughs> it is, uh... <laughs> It's, set, it's basically seven o'clock. What time do we start that? Three. Three, we started at three, ended Wasn't at seven. Was supposed to be like this long though? Like three to six. Three to six, and then we just kind of waited for the chat and then we kept talking. It was, uh, yeah, I guess technically it was supposed to be three to six. We went a little longer, we that's fine. We went over like 30 minutes. Yeah, this is, don't get me wrong, this was planned to be this type of trip. Like that was the whole point, it's for us to have. Are you okay? <laughs> I did not. I, sometimes oh. I call the shade and I'm like, well, did I lock that door? Oh, oh, yeah. Lock no, yeah, we planned for this trip to yes. have these super long discussion times. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Can you show me the trick to plugging in the car, please? Uh, yes, I can get Taylor is our designated Tesla expert. Tech, she has I'm one. basically tech support also. <laughs> yeah. So, Raven, do you feel like we accomplished anything? We may not have accomplished the exact things I thought we were gonna accomplish. Oh, there, there it is. There it is. <laughs> but we accomplished the things that needed to be accomplished, if that makes sense. Oh, I'm so glad. Like, we definitely... To, to start the action item. To made build. goals, make plans. We have action items. We already have set what we're going to talk about in our next normal meeting. We normally um, meet on Mondays. It's been very productive. All these long discussions, presentations, group, it's been a little draining, not gonna lie, just because we've had multiple multi-hour long chunks of talking and meeting, which can be just very draining to do so much in a short period of time. But that was our last one of the trip. Tonight, what I came on here to say, right now, we have a private chef in the house. Not Chef Tony, <laughs> an actual real different private chef. I believe she said she she didn't want to be on camera, so I'm not gonna film her, but I will show you the food, and I'm excited. We're all hungry now. None of us really ate a proper lunch. So yes, that is our next luxury experience in this luxury house on this luxury retreat. We are having a luxurious private chef cook us a luxurious private dinner. Okay, we just got the word that dinner is served. Let's see what it's looking like. Okay, first course is this very beautiful salad. Have you ever seen a prettier salad?
Okay, we just finished our private dining experience. The food was beautiful and very delicious. And now I am joining the crew in the hot tub. There's the heated pool and hot tub, which we have yet to use because we couldn't figure out how to heat the hot tub up. Until now, we finally figured out how to heat it up. And it's hot and toasty. How is it? We made it. It's, it's good, you good. gotta get in. I can't even see y'all. Okay. It's <laughs> worth it though. Do we have towels? I just oh, didn't know. Have towels, I just I did the first. towels are by the door. <laughs> by the aisle. We're gonna all we use our rugs. Get the towels. <laughs> yeah. Y'all about to turn into ice cubes when we get out. We took our robe and put it over there. And then we got in. No, you can't get in with your robe. Take it off. You cannot get, no fair, you no, did, you, you cheated. cheated. Just cause y'all got smart enough, <laughs> I off think about robe. getting towels. Off with the robe. Come on. There we go. Oh, it does feel good though. Ooh. Ooh. Isn't it nice? Ooh. We're all in. <laughs> we did it. Good morning. It's Monday morning. We're getting ready to leave. Here's my little airport fit. I got this cute rhinestone crew neck from Target and also this vest from Target. It's like a soft pink-ish, nude-ish color. And then I got my Lulu leggings on and my little boots that I came in and my bag kind of matches my outfit a little bit. I don't know if y'all can see the vibes, you know. Airport vibes, airport vibes. So yeah, we all just made coffee. We need to check out probably in the next 10 minutes. And we have a little bit of time before our flights. So we're probably gonna go somewhere to a local little Joshua Tree type spot and get some brunch before we head to the airport to head home. Goodbye, Wander House Joshua Tree. It's been real. So we are at Elmer's Breakfast Diner. Had good reviews and one of their famous things is this German pancake. So of course I had to get it. It's giant. Got it with strawberries. Everybody's recording except my mom. She's over here. I'm pretty sure they know how to do it. 